The report looks at the Tibetan Plateau's environmental changes, including climate, bodies of water, ecosystem, land surface environment, and the effect of human activities. The time span studied covers the last 2,000 years and looks ahead to the next 100 years. About 120 experts have been working on this program for nearly three years. The report concludes that the majority of the world's highest and largest plateau is getting warmer and wetter. Its temperature has increased twice as fast as the global average rate in the past 50 years, mainly due to global warming and the plateau's high altitude. And that has had dramatic effects on its ecosystem. From an ecosystem perspective, it's interesting. In such a cold and dry place, the ecosystem will grow better when it gets warmer and wetter. But of course, it will also bring negative impacts. For instance, it will speed up the melting of glaciers and permafrost. The Tibetan Plateau, which covers one million square kilometers, is mostly situated in the Tibet Autonomous Region, with an average altitude of over 4,500 meters. It's often referred to as the roof of the world. It's not only the source of rivers in South and East Asia, but it's also the starter and the regulating area of the climate of China and even the Northern Hemisphere. The plateau has suffered from harmful human activities, such as urbanization and the exploitation of minerals, 